so hello um today is saturday and on monday monday marks the three week date for since my uh surgery gastric bypass surgery and i thought i well, it was time for an update i don't have that much to say but we are out walking my dog i know you could hardly see him i've also borrowed a child <laughs> and here's my town my hometown people are walking on the ice it's really beautiful lovely weather so we are out for a long walk uh, since we are watching a child <laughs> uh, I started working this week so I've been working that was a good thing because I was kind of dying of boredom uh, um, on the last of my sick days and uh, so I've been working uh, for this week and that has been fine I'm eating regular food uh, more or less of course I have to tweak it a bit uh, because I have not yet learned exac exactly how to eat but I eat pretty much anything what I don't dare to try yet is like pieces of meat I'm not sure that I can chew that enough uh, so I'm trying to avoid that for now I will be eating it later on pro probably but there are a lot of other things to learn how to eat before I get to that uh, the largest difficulty has been uh, has been getting enough liquids in drinking enough because I am constantly thirsty and I'm then I want to and, and then I drink a little bit you know the little sips that I can handle and I'm still thirsty it doesn't do anything so I'm trying different things some things like milk is better milk is easier um, some kind of kinds of like berry smoothies and things like that are also easier but I can't have a liter and a half of those every day you know that's not just not doable uh, so now I'm trying I don't even know what the English word for it is. If I would directly translate it from Swedish, it is liquid replacement. So it is water, but with some salts and sugars and things like that in it, so that you can get some something more than just liquids. And that is going better. Uh, I've also had quite a lot of headaches. Not not bad headaches but it has you know been there like kind of like a mosquito in the room you know like small headaches i've had quite a lot of those and uh since trying that liquid replacement that has actually gone better so probably it was uh, just lack of uh, yeah, like, like it was probably some uh, a bit of dehydration and also lacking some salts and things like that uh, so that goes that's better now uh, I try to move quite a lot I walk a lot I walk a lot by choice and some <laughs> by force so that I can't, couldn't choose my car broke down this week so I had to be towed to the workshop and walk from there to my office so now for next week they didn't have time to take care of it yesterday uh, so they will hopefully have time for it next week we don't know uh, but hopefully couldn't drive it anyway so it doesn't matter but the week after that I actually need it so uh, I'm hoping for it to be okay uh, for next week but that means that there will be quite a lot of walking next week as well. Of course, I have, I can go by bus, but but walking will 
probably be the main way of transportation, at least for shorter distances. Uh, that's about it. Quite an uneventful week. Uh, the scabs, uh, no scabs, not that's the wrong, the caps. Now the crusts over the wounds are, try, are starting to uh, to disappear or get uh, loosen now. So uh, soon I will start like the silicone tape treatment that I will be wearing for quite some time. Now we are meeting people, so I think I'm not talking then. Uh, so. <laughs> <laughs> Happy dogs meeting. Well, there's going to go put in Sida. Bro. Hup. Well. I think that's about it. A uh, picture of the ice. This is the lake. And lots of people on it, walking, skating, skiing. Uh, it's quite a culture around the ice this time of the year. This is the best season when you live here. Uh, we call it the fifth season, <laughs> spring, winter. Uh, at times, Spring, winter, or the fifth season is just for a couple of days. Uh, this year, we have been blessed with a lot of these days and it's really, really nice. Uh, it's snowy, it's not that cold. It's just traveling around freezing point, you know, about zero mm -hmm. degrees centigrade Celsius. Uh, and um, yeah, so the, it, it isn't uh, that. And then also the sun gives us warmth for the first time since like November. And it's light and it's not dark at 3 p.m. anymore and things like that. So uh, that's about it for today. As I said, not very dramatic. I'm eating, I'm walking. I'm trying to drink as much as possible and I'm still learning. Yep, bye!